Let's say you want to create a new event on your iPad. You could do it the standard way, which is to touch the plus sign, create an event, click done. You can see it automatically generates the event for you. Now let's say you want to move that event to a different day. All you have to do is touch the event and hold on it, and you can actually drag it to a different day. It'll retain the same time when you're in month mode, but it will move it to a different day. Let's say you want to move it to a different time. You could touch the event and edit it that way. Or another option is in week mode, or in week view, you can touch the event and actually drag it to a different time. And if you want to change the duration of the event, you can also do that in this mode. You see those two little bubbles on the top and bottom. If you touch those and drag them, it'll make the event longer, or you can even have it start earlier. Another option is you can also create a new event just by touching and holding on the day and time that you'd like. So let's say you have something that you need to do on Friday at 3 o'clock. Just touch and hold. Put it right in that area. And then that's it. Touch done. And now you have another event on Friday at 3 o'clock. Those are just some simple steps getting around in calendar.